Go home! Dude! Oh shit. Hey, Vanny. No, fuck you. Hell yeah. So, 1 8 of Flumpty's 3, the third and final game of the classic FNAF fan game trilogy, all about the funny egg that is immune to the plot and can transcend time and space and may come after you as well as leave you to figure out the rest. Aww. Wait. No fucking way. Afton! The scrap trap, I think. Okay, so let's get this out of the way. Let's get the reserve tier list out of the way. Roxanne Wolf and Shattered Roxanne Wolf. By far the best, hottest characters in the entire game. This is what I had to imagine this was what the meeting at Illumix HQ was like on uh, March 25th, 2021. One week before the skin released, I guess. Okay, so we need to make a new skin and have it be out by April 1st. Anyone got any ideas? Preferably something really stupid, so the people that hate our game get on Twitter to bitch and complain while I bathe in the money I got from the poor saps who decided to pay for the cheap microtransactions. So April 1st, right? How about we do a somewhat of a blast of the past, but just for Clown Spring Trap only and then we make Prankster Bonnie. And he's got a whoopee cushion on his hand and wears glasses and one of those flowers which when you touch, it sprinkles water, and have him be colored in something ridiculous. And also maybe he could wear a party hat saying April Fools. Eh. I think fans will actually like that idea of yours and I kind of enjoy seeing fandom outcry. So new suggestion please. How about we add Chocolate Freddy and Chocolate Chica into the game as well as do a mini blast in the past for Chocolate Bonnie and Easter Bonnie to promote our recently released Funko figures which we will probably never do for any other skin ever again. We kinda felt too money hungry that day when we made an agreement with Scott and Funko. I like your thinking, but again, that's what fans want and we don't care. What the hell was that? Oh shit, I left my fucking chocolate bonnie action figure in the microwave again. Hey, that's gonna be our next skin, a melted version of chocolate bonnie. All we have to do is add a few melted splodges onto the chocolate bonnie model and boom, you guys get off early this week and get paid. I want to get out of here. Like, that's what seems to be what happened here. This is inexcusable to the maximum. Today I'm here to announce our biggest addition to the city, and is a comedy yet. I bring you Hurricane Utah NFTs! This sounds like a fucking scam! Do you think we're stupid? Oh no, somebody screenshot one of my NFTs! Go, go, go! <laughs> Uh, here's a picture of helping. I don't care what the only few Illumix and FNAF AR fans say anymore. Hate on me all you want, but this game's a fucking scam. And in my opinion, Five Nights at Freddy's AR Special Delivery is the worst Five Nights at Freddy's game in the entire franchise. F tier. No questions asked. Moving on because I'm tired of talking about this god-awful, miserable excuse of the game. 
and Illumix get bankrupt. Ah. Oh. Oh. Cancel him! Cancel him! I'm even afraid of you! Boom! You were right. Thank you so much, Tyler. You're a great friend. Boom! Cancel him! Boom! Boom! Cancel him! 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 Of course, Afton wasn't like this in the original games, but with the clever use of exaggeration, they amp Afton's evilry up to a hundred to show what he's really about. He's a psychopath. Also, the use of Viking guards and the emphasis on the line, this attraction is great, is a subtle nod to how creepily Springtrap is attracted to the audio the player uses against him, as well as moments when he's staring at the player, making it seem like he's attracted. Luhini knows what he's doing. So I guess that really shows that Five Nights at Freddy's 3 The Musical Animation Song by Luhini is the best Five Nights at Freddy's song of all time stuff. How can you not remember this dude? Golden Freddy. You can't talk about FNAF Easter eggs and secrets without referring to Golden Freddy's appearance in the first FNAF game. He's the single embodiment of what makes a FNAF seeker or easter egg complete. I'll see you at Christmas, Dad. Very well, son. Have a great life. Hi, this is Tyler Land 264 slash slash Minecraft and more. Welcome back guys to find it's a pretty sister location. So you guys may be wondering, how did I get the three stars with that me doing in a video? Well, I, just, I said work ahead because uh, yeah. I did not expect to like this chapter at all. I thought it would be just as shit or even shittier than chapter one. But I'm legitimately surprised that I actually liked this chapter. Did it! Let's go! <laughs> Alright, so you're either gonna like or hate the ending. Oh, that's it? No six mate? Hello, Oh, hello! I always wondered why you answered the phone. Little chaos, welcome. Ooh, I love the ocean. You know, I wasn't sure this was how the story would end. Oh, oh it's the next genius. Yeah. I was broke. I don't, I don't mind it. <laughs> don't make your opinion out to be as fact and truthful as possible. Don't make your opinion try to sound more factual and more valid than the opposing opinion. And at the end of the day, both opinions on Secure Breach and just any game in general really are equally valid. There's no need to start wars and fights and arguments on the internet over a silly bear game, man. And if you still feel like putting others down for their opinions on the game after watching this, do me and many people a favor and grow up. We did it! First try! Oh shit! Yo, what the fuck? I used to struggle with this back in the day. What the fuck? You win. Don't come back. Pings live knows eternity. I got fired from my own fucking room. How beautiful. <laughs> yes! Holy shit! We did it! Ah! Fuck yes! You win, don't come back in police survival mode, pink slip.
Fuck you. I'm done with this shit. Yeah. What are you all doing here? We came here today to thank you for taking my niece, Abby, to the hospital. Even if it meant losing the race. That was really sweet of you. Your niece? Yep. Thank you. Thank you so much. And because of that, we decided to give you a little surprise. Oh? You're the real winner, Tyler. Three cheers for Tyler! This is by far the biggest controversy associated with the Five Nights at Freddy's franchise, simply because it's all about the creator of the franchise himself, Scott Cawthon. And we won. Yay! Yay! Good job, you little cunt! I'm on a fucking drug trip right now, look at this shit. <laughs> Yo. A wheel, you win. <laughs> the fucking the fucking watermark on the image just makes it amazing. I don't care for the color choices. Looks very detailed, but in a good way. Not a bad idea for BB. Shockingly great skin. Father like. Garvey isn't just a William Afton variation. Garvey Wright is a representation and self insert of Nietzsche. Both are pedophiles and love the concept of rape, especially against children. There has never been a fan game developer that has been more disgusting than this genuine sack of shit. Not even Jonochrome was this bad. Nietzsche deserves to be locked away, get his testicles cut off, to be beat to a pulp, and never interact with any children ever again. Rape sucks. Child rape sucks. The lore of Dormitibus sucks, Garvey Wright sucks, and most of all, most importantly, Nietzsche fucking sucks. This dude's fucking art. LET'S GO! We fucking- Unless you're saying I'll leave you the DLC! Oh. Let's go, dudes. Let's go, guys. At the end of the day, Darkest Desire and This Comes From Inside both stand out to me for being two modern FNAF songs that actually attempted more than what the current genre of FNAF songs attempt, and quite honestly just shows how bland and dull and uninspired most FNAF songs are nowadays. I love the old FNAF songs, and I'd love the few exceptions in this modern era of FNAF songs, and quite frankly, we need more unique gems. Five Nights at Fuckboys walked so Day Shift at Freddy's could run. The Day Shift at Freddy's trilogy, my god, I fucking love this trilogy to death. And these three FNAF fan games are personally three of my favorite FNAF fan games of all fucking time. While it's not completely perfect, this game is amazing. And for the first game in the series that started it all, that is incredible. Since of course this is the first game, therefore first episode, there's no other game in the series right now on the ranking scale besides this game, so this game for right now is at number one. And later on, when there are more games on this scale, I don't expect this game to be dropped down the ranking significantly because this game is one of my favorites in the series, and overall is a genius, cliche and trope breaking, memorable spin on the horror game scene forever. An easy S tier. You're under, you're under arrest. You like Poppy Playtime, you're under arrest. Oh yeah. Oh, why? You have a different opinion in the FNAF community. You're under arrest. No, wait. You like FNAF AR. You're under arrest. I actually don't know what it is. Wait. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Wait. It's 
6 a.m. It's Morbid time. Subscribe to find a as well, I should mention, the fanverse and fan games in general are what we got for right now when it comes to FNAF until the release of Security Breach Ruin. This constant negativity for the fanverse is undeserved, and I think it needs to be supported and appreciated much more than it currently does. If you're someone who believes the fanverse is completely dead, and it's a failure, and you encourage people to not support it, please, treat the fanverse and the wonderful people behind it much better. They deserve it. Day Shift at Freddy's 3 is my favorite FNAF fan game of all time. <gasps> one more hook! One more! One more! Let's go! Yes! Let's go! Let's get go! Ooh, ooh, ooh! Oh, something gonna happen? Something's gonna happen? Oh! Oh! Pop goes the weasel! Oh, little buddy! Hey! I love your walk cycle, by the way. It looks really smooth and great. Oh, 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 Someone left tickets and shit on the air hockey, but oh, oh, and on the claw machine too. Oh. The office, dude. Use your real, use your weasel ear phone to play awesome games here. Yo, evergreen office. Yo, yo, yo. <gasps> Holy shit! We said, yo, to be continued in. Pop goes evergreen. Pop goes evergreen. Yo, hey. Listen to me, fat pig. Thank you, Scott Cawthon, for what you've given us. Thank you so much. It, you created, I know that what happened last year happened with all of that with the donations, but even then, I want to thank you so much for creating one of my favorite franchises of all time. It was extremely, um, I don't know what to say, but you made something great, and even besides like the whole donation drama, I still support you, and I thank you for um, everything. You create a lot of memories for me and a lot of people in the community. You created a community, you know, you gave so many people a great time, good years, and yeah. The stream's dedicated to you, man. Love you, Scott. And, um, yeah. I love when I understand game. I love when I- I LOVE WHEN I UNDERSTAND GAME! Let's go! Still one of the best, but not the best. That goes to... Ah, yes. You don't know how much this trailer made me hype for Sister Location. 559! <laughs> no, no, I'll actually be fucking done if I die. If I... How? How the fuck did I win that? That's bullshit! What the f- What? What? How did I win that? That is- there's no way I did that legit. We're gonna be- we're gonna beat Grizzlies. We beat Grizzlies! Let's go! We beat the best game of all time! Don't 
disappoint Sadie Grizzly. That's the first day I see. I love this song, period. It's both my favorite FNAF song and my favorite song based off of a video game. I think a lot of you saw this coming. Did my game just fucking crash? Did my game just fucking crash? Are you kidding me? Are you joking right now? Are you fucking for real? Oh, fun YouTube, I guess, but are you kidding me? Are you actually fucking serious? What the hell? What the hell? For the first time in Tyler Land 264 FNAF Top 5 slash 10 history, we got a tie for first place. I am literally so undecided in who's the fucking worst, because the reasons for them being both number one are the exact damn same as each other. Simply, the joy of creation is a quality FNAF fan game. See, 
they're safe now, just as you wanted. Thank you for your cooperation, Scott Coughlin. I'll take care of everything from here. Yep, my opinion from my top 5 worst FNAF songs remake still remains. I do not like this song at all. Who didn't see this coming? If you've seen any video on my channel related to FNAF songs, you know how much I love this song. Again, if I had to rank these from worst to best, 5am at Freddy's for the weakest, then 5am at Freddy's the final horror views, then 5am at Freddy's the prequel, and for the best, 5am at Freddy's the sequel. What can I say? It's all golden. The chunks have yet to be loaded in while they have not. Bendy? Hey, Bendy! He's playing a little choo-choo train. <laughs> choo choo! Hey, Bendy. Oh my goodness. Is he gonna be nice or, f or evil? Well, there's only one way to find out. Hey there. Talk. Oh shit. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't know that was going to be Oh, damn. Damn. Damn it. I want to hug Bendy. Dude, I want to give Bendy a hug too. Oh my. Oh. Oh my. Oh. Holy shit! Holy shit! <gasps> Yo! You did it! Yes! <laughs> we did it! I think? I think. This is different from before, at least. Yo. No. 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 Yo. Yo, what? Yo, what the fuck? Yo. Yo. Yo, what? Bendy fucking saved us. Yo! Alright! Let's go! The end! Let's go! The end! Let's go! Yes! Yo! Yo! Holy shit! Bendy! Hey, we get to keep Bendy! Let's go! As toxic as the FNAF community becomes, and as the official franchise itself keeps declining, Five Nights at Freddy's identity is still going to be in our hearts, and this comes from inside is a perfect representation of that very simple truth. Yes! Let's go! And the thing went up to 35%, and then you have the house. Let's go! Night 4 complete. One more minute. Come on. Yes, let's go. Let's go. Let's. We did it. Oh, 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 oh. Oh. 
Did we beat it? Did we beat it? Did we beat it? Let's go! 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 Get the fuck out of here! Mick Mick, whatever the fuck your name is, get the fuck out of my fucking thing. Friends. Friends.